Okay. Here we go. Let's talk about these shoes. As we get rolling into the studio, blue bar on your screen, you know what that means. Perk up your ears. Fractal in the house. Bucket hats, okay? I got different sizes. They sent me a box of hats, and I just don't need all the hats. These are brand new. I think based in Australia. Everybody down under. Where's Fractal based out of Australia? Let's put another shrimp on the ball, babe. How are you going to win this hat? Um, I will send this off to you. The first person. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah. We're back on Instagram. That's right. Here is the new handle to go follow on Instagram. Instagram is really the main place I usually do giveaways, just so you know. And so at Demore Global Running. That's that's straightforward. All right. At Demore Global Running, go give it a follow. And the first person to tag that account in a story, not in a post, in a story, and then answer this question uh, on Instagram. What was the last city I did a tune-up race in? All right, there you go. That's it. What was the last city I did a tune-up race in from the moment of this publishing? All right, there you have it, Fractel. I will send this bucket hat. Very nice to have in the hot summer training months. Okay, there you go. Let's put those over there. Three pillars to your running shoe rotation early 2023. Obviously, we're still waiting for like the Kinvara 14 to become available. So these are really shoes that many of you already own. Um, and what is a running shoe rotation? We've been making vlogs on this channel for six years, which means the library is vast. It's large. So here's three vlogs on your screen right now that you can go check out that will help you build out your running shoe rotation. All right, they're also listed down below in the description. How to build a running shoe rotation. The Matrix playlist. Oh my goodness. So many people watch those vlogs and it's basically combining all the different run types that might be in your weekly, monthly training regimen and how to attach different shoes to different run types, okay? And then last but not least, pinching pennies, nine running shoes for under $100 right now. All right, I'll link down below. And if you head over to the website, demoreglobalrunning.com, right on the homepage, we're building out, it's still in the works, but you'll see we're building out the favorites or the top rated running shoes in DGR on the website. There you go, everybody, go check that out. All right, road and trail, let's dive in. Oh, running shoe rotation. Here's the deal. Okay, yeah, question of the day actually first. I had to think for a second. Question of the day, you can only choose three. I'm sorry, I realize like many of you have 10 pairs, many of you have 15 pairs, many of you have six pairs, Not, but we're gonna limit it, all right? I wanna make sure that we're helping people that are especially just getting into running, how they can build out a rotation without you know, spending $1,000 or spending $2,000, okay? So here we go, you can only pick three. Which three running shoes are in your running shoe rotation in early 2023? You can only pick three, all right? So here we go. Easy and daily, all right? That's one category, that's how I do it. Easy and daily, all right? Because you gotta combine run types, okay? I'll explain more here, easy and daily. Uh, tempo and long run threshold and racing. Easy daily, tempo long run, that's the tough one, tempo long run. Um, and I'll explain again more and then threshold and racing. So let's just start at the top. Easy and daily. I like an easy day shoe that actually forces me to go a little bit slower, okay? It's the Fresh Foam More V4, all right? Now, many people, I'll give some honorable mentions. Of course, the SC Trainer from New Balance as well, but for me, uh, that energy arc plate inside the midsole. It's just a little too much for my liking. I must say though, when legs are really tired, this is a good option, okay? But most of the time, New Balance Fresh Foam More V4, okay? And then it does cross over, and that's what, again, we're honorable mention to that daily trainer category. Now again, you can niche down even more, but we're forcing it to just three shoes. Here we go, Tempo Long Run. This is the tough one. You might say, Seth, of course, it's gonna be the Triumph 20. Uh-uh-uh, a little too heavy, let's fire up the scale. I, I love the shoe for a long run. Now for all the new runners, rookie runners, someday maybe you will have five, six, 10 shoes in your rotation. But for now, you're starting with three, okay? Here we go, three pillars of the running shoe, 8.7. It's just too heavy for a, long, uh, a tempo day, okay? But that's where, of course, the Noosa comes in. All right, coming in at a hot six, Point 
eight ounces in my size. And so because of that weight, you can definitely pick up the paces in it. And it has enough midsole protection to go the long run. Now for me, again, you gotta, you gotta think. I like to pick up the paces on a long run a little bit, meaning I wanna keep the pace honest. Steady and a little bit more than steady, okay? So that's 6.45 to seven minutes a mile for me. Um, and that's where the Noosa just rocked it for me. And again, I realize this is an old shoe at this point. We're kind of waiting for the Noosa Tri-15, but it's still there. Um, knocking out tempo days because of the weight. And now again, I realize some people will uh, we'll, we'll buy other shoes just for a tempo day. I get it, but again, three shoe rule for today. And last but not least, threshold and training. You know the drill. Actually, the Endorphin Elite is off at a photo shoot. I'm sorry it's not here. Full review uh, write-up is over on the website, demoreglobalrunning.com. And then, of course, the next percent, too. Now, I'm talking specifically about the roads. I'm not talking about track. I'm not talking about cross-country. I'm talking about the road. So honorable mention, Nike Next Percent 2 for currently early 2023. All right, there you have it on the trails. I'm just going to mention briefly, easy and daily, Brooks Caldera 6. It's still there, forcing you to slow down, but has tons of midsole stack height. Wow, Brooks Caldera 6, great outsole, unbelievable. Tempo long run, still going. Where is it? Ooh, is it here? Speed Go 5, it definitely was here. There it is. Hocus Speed Go 5, 100%. All right, tempo and long runs out on the trails. Hocus Speed Go 5. And then for threshold and racing, we're going to go. This is okay. So this is actually, this is hard because trail races are so diverse with vertical gain, with the type of terrain under step, you know, is it gravelly, is it rocky, is it sandy, is it muddy, is it, so it's really, you have to be, you have to really, really niche down in the trail running world. Uh, but I will mention Saucony Endorphin Edge, Solomon Pulsar, and then the Innovate uh, X Talon G210 for just like aggressive, short, fast. That's what I often use for FKTs here in Colorado. Okay, did I dig? Did I get it all? There's the comment of the day. Onward and upward. Okay, soak it in. Comment of the day, C.S. Wells. I absolutely agree that the BOA lacing system is probably going to become more, and I was using the BOA yesterday, I think it was, for the Jackal from La Sportiva, okay? I just hope that the companies that integrate it are smart enough with the placement of the dial. C.S. Wells, I could not agree more. Just so you know, Jackal 2 BOA yesterday. Mwah. So awesome in the snow. Like I just felt so secure. It was amazing. And they put enough padding underneath the dial so it doesn't irritate the top of your foot. Thank you, C.S. Wells, for the great comment of the day. These shoes are listed down below on uh, demoreglobalrunning.com. Thanks for picking them up through the uh, links down below. Helps me make these daily vlogs. Helps us move forward, keep the lights on. And we got, we got a lot of light in the shoe to yo, everybody. All right, everyone. Onward we go. We'll toss it to the... Uh, running Shoe Matrix Playlist. Running Shoe Matrix Playlist, right there, right there. All right, again, Instagram, Instagram, come on. Fractal, who's gonna win? All right, seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.